You grab these guys, this, this. These guys are fucking aggroed onto you, so they're not doing that. They're usually here. And then you just jump behind them, do these moves in this order. And then they fucking die with giants. I just got a black shard. I actually just got a black shard. I actually just got a black shard. No, it's not. Do it. Leave the guild. I actually just got a fucking black shard. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another video. And um, we're just going to jump right into it. I rerolled the Zerker. <laughs> I finally rerolled the Zerker. I've been wanting to play Zerker for such a long time. And honestly, like, I had a Zerker alt for a while, as you guys know. I played it pretty often but almost strictly as like a pve alt um and i didn't ever pvp'd on it i wasn't you know set up correctly to pvp on it i didn't really have the like good gear or very much ap or anything like that and now i finally decided to you know full commit full reroll over to zerker and in order to do that i have to coupon over my full pen weapons i have to still do a ton of sp grinding and uh i also have to get rid of my evasion gear including my pen levers um that was a tough pill to swallow because i just made those pen levers but overall i'm pretty happy that everything is working out the way it is um after selling everything and starting to buy back some of the dr gear that i needed I decided to try to enhance my boss armors that I had previously that I was using to click for pen. I was playing clicking those things maybe for Ted for profit, you know? And um, we, we we did pretty bad. Uh, we, we lost a lot of money on these. Um, I don't know why I thought I was gonna hit these to Ted easily, but I failed a lot. I can't really remember how many I failed in one night, but it was a fuckload. Like I lost, I made three 100 stacks, like three, bro, three. And it was pretty painful. You guys can see I'm just failing left and right, left, right and center here. And um, that was a big mistake. It was pretty big tilt, not gonna lie. But um, yeah, just to talk a little bit more about why I decided to go Zerker. Um, really, you know, it's, it's hard to explain. The easiest way I could say it is that I I basically just wanted a playstyle change. Uh, Ninja Succession uh, Awakening are really fun, uh, but they do one thing and they go like, you know, you run in, you 1vx, and I've been wanting to <clears throat> more support and be like a little bit more useful for like a team or a ball, I kind of play in the ball, because I've never actually played inside of the ball um, or, you know, been a person who's going to be able to like support from the ball and that's kind of what i was looking for at first i was thinking oh, i should go play archer uh, because that's exactly what they're supposed to do like you're supposed to play like archer's like perfect for that right um so i was thinking you know why not do that but then i thought to myself i was like i never actually gave zerker a fair shake like i played it as a pve alt i never actually played it for full pvp and i should do that like i should finally actually give Zerker a full try and that's what I'm doing right now uh, I've had so much fun on it the last couple of days and that's why I haven't been streaming over at twitch.tv slash stress I go follow that uh, but that's why I haven't been streaming as much um, I am working on you know getting some gear upgrades it's been this this has been a this has been a little bit of a delay in terms of you know how things are working out but ended up deciding to uh, actually you know, when I, since I had to sell all my evasion stuff, I had levers were worth more than bags, and I decided I wanted to get my pen bags. Uh, but before I did that, I just decided to buy everything at Tet, um, so I could actually go and actually grind. Uh, because I was sitting around like waiting for buy orders and sell orders to go through, and I was getting super impatient. I'm horribly impatient when it comes to stuff like that. So we bought the Tet full Tet, and then. Uh, we were able to actually get a buy order. We had to pay max price, but we still came out ahead in terms of like, you know, after all, getting absolutely washed on the taxes. I think we're still doing pretty good in that regard. Um, but uh, currently what we're looking at for gear is uh, we are currently sitting at 
291, 290, 316 with pen bags instead of pen levers. We've got full DR with Kaffir level three. And uh, we also replaced our Kudum as well. So we have a Tech Kudum as well. So we'll 326 with that. We also did a, for our first Node War on Zerker, which is pretty fun. I The Node War is interesting. Um, I was against, it was against uh, Galactus or Galaxy. Um, and it was really fun, but they have a lot of like high gear, like, uh, skirmishing classes. And, uh, that was the first time being on the receiving end of the skirmishing classes, but it was still super fun. Um, here's the scores on this, on the screen. We ended up losing. They had a really good base placement and, uh, it was a really fun fight. Hour 45. Uh, love to fight them again. Those guys are, those guys are really fun to fight. Um, so the node war felt pretty good, but. Uh, I'm just excited for the future, guys. Like, I'm really excited. I'm going to start pushing gear. I'm probably going to try to get to 324 uh, with a Nuver. Uh, and then that's going to be able to put me at uh, 334 with uh, Kudum. And then that's perfect for Sakrya. So that's what our goal is. I think we're going to get a Tet Tungrad first. But at the moment, I think I think we're sitting pretty good. And I know you guys are probably have a lot of questions. So leave down leave the questions down in the comments. Let's talk. Let's have a conversation. I'll be talking about this over at twitch.tv slash satisfied on stream stuff like that it's gonna be a good time uh this is like just a little update video in that regard um keeping it short simple sweet hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one Woo!